Our first step is to unbolt the OEM drive shaft carrier from the car in order to cut it. Your car might have a heat shield between the exhaust and drive shaft. If so, remove that first. This shouldn't require removal of the exhaust itself, but lowering it down can give you more room to work with if you prefer. Now cut the carrier frame. Begin by cutting one side, above the mounting tab. Then thread it back into the body to make your next cut on the opposite side's mounting tab. Then unbolt it from the body and it should come free. Now, use a razor blade to cut all the way around and remove the inner frame from the rest of the bearing. Cut the excess rubber from the lip at the front of the bearing. Feel around the back of the bearing for where it feels softer and make another cut all the way around to remove all of the rubber hanging off the rear of the bearing. Then cut the remaining raised excess rubber all the way around until it's flush with the front half of the bearing. Essentially, you're making this a flat surface. Leave the base layer of rubber intact. Your bearing should look about like this when you're done. Now install your new carrier. Take the top half with a bushing in it and put it over top of the bearing with the text facing the front of the vehicle. Then bring the bottom half up to meet it and connect the two together using the provided Allen bolts. As you tighten the bolts, switch back and forth from left to right so the bolts don't bind in the holes. A small gap may form between the two bushings. This is normal. Now, to mount it to the car, take your bolt, put a fender washer on it, an isolation damper facing up, go up into the carrier, bring another isolation damper down from the top, and then put your small washer on the very top. Loosely thread it into the body. Same thing on the other side. Bolt, fender washer, isolation damper, up through the carrier, another isolation damper down from the top, and a small washer on the very top. Thread it into the body and tighten both bolts to 19 newton meters and enjoy your new JXB driveshaft carrier.